السلام علیکم ایوان دس از عبد الصمد انور فرام حبیب بلاگس سو فسٹ آف آل آئی وش یو اینڈ یو فیملی رمدان مبارک مے اللہ گیو از دی اسٹرینتھ ٹو فلفل دی نیڈس آف دس منتھ سو ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو ٹیل یو دی لیٹسٹ اپ ڈیٹس فرام سعودی عربیہ سو واچ دس ویڈیو ٹل دی اینڈ اینڈ ڈونٹ فور گیٹ ٹو سبسکرائب ٹو مائی چینل ٹرن آن دی نوٹیفیکیشن بٹن اینڈ کلک دی بیل آئیکن سو وین ایور آئی ول اپ ڈیٹ مائی ویڈیو یو ول گیٹ دا نوٹیفیکیشن ایوری ٹائم So welcome back everyone. I am going to show you a tweet by Makkah region, the official page of Saudi Arabia. So I am not going to tell you anything by myself or something fake. So this is the update by Makkah region. As you can see here, I have just translated it in English so everyone can read it. Saudi Arabia announces that restaurants activities in all region of the kingdom will be from 3 p.m. to 3 a.m. during the month of Ramadan. Only the timing change previously identified conditions remains the same drive through online app ordering and delivery. So this is the tweet by Makkah region as you can see here this is not a fake news it's authentic news. You can check the link I will give you in the description so you can click it and get to their Twitter account. So we will get to our second update. Our second update is from the official account of uh, Ministry of Human Resources and Social Development. So they have announced the working hours for the public and private sectors during a month of Ramadan Ministry of Human Resources and Social Development announces that the working hours for the month of Ramadan are as follows Working hours for public sectors is 5 hours a day starting from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. Working hours for private sector is 6 hours a day So as you can see here It's written in Arabic but I have translated just for you guys it is uh, tweeted from Ministry of Human Resources and Social Development you can check it their Twitter account I will give you the link in the description so I'm going to show you the third update and the last update from Saudi Arabia so this article is written by Saudi Gazette I'm going to read it out for you guys so listen carefully and read it carefully all grocery stores and supply shops in the kingdom are required to provide electronic payment e payment methods effective may 10 the national program for combating commercial cover up the satur announced on tuesday this order from ministry of commerce is in order to reduce cash circulation amid the coronavirus outbreak the deadline to abide with the new rule is may 10 the decision under the ministry of commerce and investments program to combat commercial cover ups is in the line with the kingdom precautionary measures to slow and contain the spread of the deadly virus all grocery and supply shops are required to provide electronic payment e payment methods so that's all for today i have told you about three updates from saudi arabia i hope everyone is now aware of these updates so now you just have to do one of my works subscribe to my channel it keeps me motivated and in making more videos for you guys so remember me in your prayers so this is abdul samad anwar from habibi vlogs signing off